So hi everyone, welcome to the brand new session um, that is Zoho month. So my topic is Zoho people, which is a HRM tool. Uh, so it is kind of a pay wheel like we use on, on our daily office uh, use. So it is kind of that tool, but we have more uh, features, uh, you know, uh, which gives us uh, more like a press from the hiring till the exit. So your pay, your payrolls, your salary slips, everything will be in this. You you will also be able to view that. And HR will be able to do the appraisals and etc. They will be able to track your uh, track a VA's life cycle, like from the day of joining till the exit. So going forward, I'll be explaining you all those details. So let's see uh, what is Zoho people. So uh, Zoho people are suitable for business of all sizes. Uh, Zoho people uh, helps improve HR efficiency by automating administrative tasks. Zoho people is a cloud-based HRM management system that helps organization manage and streamline their HR processes. It provides features like employee database management, leave tracking, time sheets, performance evaluation, centralized repository, uh, document storage, organizational chats, version control, and audit trial. Onboarding and offboarding, reporting and employee self-service portal. So as I said, from uh, the life cycle of an uh, of a employee, from the date of joining, like uh, when you join, your profile will be created. From there till you apply for your leaves, uh, your uh, you can see uh, the general leaves, uh, all those things, your evaluation. Uh, so the manager will be able to give your uh, performance appraisal evaluation uh, through this Soho People tool. We don't have to do a, a separate manual process for that. So the key features of Zoho People is employee database management, centralized and easy accessible employee records, leave management, request and approve leaves and track leave balances, attendance tracking, monitor attendance, shift scheduling, check-ins and checkouts. Timesheets, manage and track employee hours for specific projects of task. Performance management, that is 360 degree feedback appraisals and goal settings. And so a self-service portal, employee can access personal records, apply for leave and check attendance. So these are the key features. Uh, you will be able to, uh, the best part is uh, you will be able to track it in your mobile as well. So you can do all these features in mobile as well as like we do in Paywheel. So kind of that. And uh, the benefits of, of Zoho P uh, people, uh, centralized HR data, all employee information in one place, easy to access and manage. Automation automates repetitive HR task, freeing up time for HR teams to focus on more strategic work, customizable workflows, tailoring workflows for attendance, approvals, etc. Employee engagements allow employee to manage personal information, leave requests and feedback through a self-service portal. Compliance and security ensure data security and compliance with labor laws. About the employee database management, a uh, comprehensive record stores detailed employee information such as your personal details, your job history, your performance. So your qualification can be feeded like what your uh, your graduation, your your are you a postgraduate? Also your uh, uh, previous uh, work uh, work experience can be recorded. An organizational structure easily visualize organizational hierarchy and reporting lines. So you will be having a base, like you will be having a flow chat where uh, your hierarchy level can be managed and tracked. So you will know whom to report for what. So that will be given in a flow chat basis, your hierarchy levels. And the document storage, upload and store documents like contracts, certifications and offer letters. So there is a column called document storage where you can go and download your offer letters, your uh, probation letters, your appraisal letters, your salary slips, uh, your uh, contracts. Everything will be saved uh, uh, securely in the document storage where you will have to enter a password. Uh, that is your date of birth, a day kind of thing. So uh, when you enter that, you will get the uh, documents.
easy search and a retrieval search and retrieve employee information quickly through filters so we have various filters like dates we have uh, names uh, name filters so we can quickly like for which uh, employee we are uh, checking the probation period or the uh, appraisal period or uh, if we want to know the joining of the employee we can go, uh, uh, give a filter search where we can quickly get the employee details about the leave management uh, leave policies set up leave policies uh, based on company rules leave request employee can request leave through the self service portal real time balance track leave balances and accruals uh, in real time approval workflow automate leave approval process and notification which we are all doing in paywill the same processes like uh, we can uh, apply for leaves we can uh, uh, track the leave balances uh, uh, the hr can approve the leave uh, seeing the workflow like uh, seeing the balance of the employee and uh, we can also set up the leave policies as per the company rules uh, the performance management, this is the best part, uh, 360 degree feedback uh, or holistic performance assessment that gives insights from manager, peace and direct reports for self-improvement. So when I refer to a few videos, uh, uh, there is a tab where uh, you can give feedbacks, not only the managers, but also your peers or uh, your seniors whoever you're working on the particular project, whom are you reporting to, all will be having access to give you a feedback. How did you do the task or how 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 do they rate your task? So it will be uh, easy for you to take the feedback and work on it and improve your uh, uh, positioning. And timesheets and project management. So time tracking, uh, track time spent on specific tasks or projects. So you can, uh, uh, you know, like a toggle, you can track the time for the specific task. Billable hours. Identify billable versus non-billable hours for accurate invoicing. So uh, for which like OT kind of uh, uh, task, if you are, uh, if it is billable, then you can track your hours. Client and project management, link employee time sheets to projects and clients. So you can, uh, you know, tag your uh, clients uh, the, uh, to know the status of the, of the task or the project you're doing. Reports, generate reports on employers and project timeless. So you can um, uh, generate the reports of, for which task or a free, which project you're doing or for how many employees do you want to see the time tracking or their uh, uh, leave balance or whatever it is. It is easy to generate the reports. Just need to, ta uh, you know, uh, disable the uh, uh, ticks and then you, can, you will be able to generate the reports as per that. Self-service portal. Access employee information. Employee can view and edit personal details. Leave request, apply for leaves and check leave balances. Attendance, check attendance and shift schedules. Performance feedback, give and receive feedback. So uh, you have uh, all the access to edit your profile as per your flexibility and apply for leaves and check your leave balances. And uh, if there is any shift like uh, allotted to you by the company, you can see your shift like when is the shift allotted to you for the week or the month or the uh, a quarterly basis. And uh, also uh, uh, regarding your performance, uh, you will be able to see the feedback regarding your task you have performed. And we can also access it in mobile as I told you before, like we can, we can manage it in our mobile as well. On the go access, manage attendance, leaves and approvals from anywhere. Geolocation tracking, use mobile-based check-ins to monitor remote employee attendance. So as we do it in the pay bill, like uh, we can track the uh, employee uh, location as well. Uh, push notice, uh, sorry, not uh, not as per the pay bill, we cannot uh, track the location in pay bill, but in uh, Geo Zoho people, we can track the location of the uh, remote employees. Push notifications, real-time notification for approvals, reminders, and updates. And uh, Zoho People is a comprehensive HRM tool that offers automation, customization, and integration, making it easier to manage HR processing. So I have a, a, a demo video for you how it works. This is for the beginners, which is very basic, and uh, it will be like a, a you know a tutorial.
So let's get started. First, what you have to how to use the whole people of I hope everyone hi guys can welcome hear the back video. today i'm going to be showing you how you can use zoho yes, people as yes, a complete yes. beginner to create your own sales services to organize your team do automation add integrations and more so let's get started first what you have to do is you will go to people.zoho.com or you can go to zoho.com slash people zoho is a technology company with a lot of different products for us to choose from and we can go to zoho crm zoho books and there are a lot of different products when it comes to zoho hr we get zoho people if you already have a zoho account then you will not have to sign up for zoho people and you can just go ahead and get your own account but if you want to sign up you can sign up for zoho people separately with your email address and or your google account so once you sign up this is where you will get this is zoho people People. now let me show you around how we use it so first of all we have services option right here so in services you will be able to see all of these different services that we have on people we have leave tracker time tracker attendance performance files organization travel compensation announcement cases hr letter onboarding and i can create my own new service let's say that i wanted to create a new service so i will just click right here and enter a name for my service i'm gonna go ahead and call it test for description I, i'm just gonna write the word description we can click and choose an icon for this let's go with this one now i will click on save and you will see a new service will be created if i go back to services you can see this is my test service that i just created so now I can go and one by one check out all of these different services. Let's go to leave tracker. Leave tracker means that I will be able to track leaves of my all different team members and my own. We get a list view, calendar view, leave applications. For example, all the applications that my organization or my team members have sent, I will find them here. Then we have holidays and settings. So this is leave tracker. Let's go back to services. And this time, let's check out time tracker. So in time tracker, again, we have different time logs and we get a list view and a calendar view. To track time, what I can do is I can just click on this start timer and it will start the timer for me. You can see right here, I will select a job first. So let's go ahead and add a job quickly to track time. Let's call it job one and submit. So that is how you create a job. And we can also select a project. How to create a new project? Click on add project here and give your project a name. So let's call it project one. Click on submit. Now we have project and a job. And then we can simply add what are you working on? Let's just call it new task. If it's billable, then you can select billable from here. If it's non-billable, then you can select non-billable. So I'm going to select billable and click right here and it will start my timer. And now the time is tracking. So that's how easy it is to track time with people. And I can track time for my different team members and I can manage my organization and team very efficiently using Zoho people. Let's stop it. Just click on it and it will stop the time for you. And now we have a new entry. Let's go back to services. And similarly, now I can go to attendance, performance, files, organization, compensation, announcement cases, and more. It's really easy to use. You can just check them out one by one. For example, organization. In organization, I will be getting departments, um, designations, exits, new hires, favorites. If you want to invite a user and you want someone to manage the section for you, you can just go to invite users and you will be able to invite someone one so you can just give them an id add their first name add their last name select the department they are in hr select the location zoho role what role they have they're actually a team member then we have employment types so i can select that it's permanent job then employment status it's active source of hire so we can select a source from where we're actually hiring people and they will know so it's going to be direct Similarly, I can select a designation and you can just add a new designation as well from this option. Add a designation name. Let's just call it new. Click on submit. 
and a new designation is added. So once you've added all of these information, make sure you add your email address and their address here. Once you have selected it, then do not use Microsoft Excel without chat GPT and AI because click on submit and your new employee will be added and you will be able to send them an invite so you can see right here i have a new team member and they will be managing everything and i have actually employed a person i have given their information that this is one of my employee that will be working here i can also import a, an employee list if i like so that doesn't mean you have to add them one by one so this is our organization we have department uh, we have birthday folks new hires favorites group task and setting i can create different groups of people um, to manage better on um, right here zoho so click on add group and now i can give my group a name and i can divide my different employees into different groups so that they can communicate better so services is here right i showed you services let's go to home uh, when we go to home so home is really simple we have our time tracking right here we have like an overview of what's happening our time logs are um if there is any birthday coming up attendance so this is going to be an overview that we get right here on home if i go to self-service now this is my account this is for us because we created zoho and we are the ceo this is our zoho and every employee will have its own self-service here i can check my my tasks my goals my files and my information, this is like for us. And I can check all of the information here. I can enter about me. I can add my skill set, work information, tags, and then I can add my cases, goals, attendance. I can check my attendance here, delegation, travel expense, exit details, everything. Then we again have leave tracker. So I showed you leave from services. We have organization. If I click on more, it will again open up the services for me that I just showed you from this section. So we can also avail them from here. We have files, we have announcement, HR letters, onboarding. I can also customize my tabs if I like. Click on customize and you can check that what are the different services you have. Let's say that I do not have travel. So I can just uncheck this one. I can uncheck this one as well maybe this one so now they will not be shown on my zoho people and i will be able to customize it the way i like so this is the main menu where we work it's really easy to use and a very organized platform for us to manage our team then we have the report right here at the bottom and report gives us all the insights to everything you can check out your different dashboards leave tracker attendance again each of our service has its own dashboard and has its own reports and analytics stats that we can check if i go to right here to my account i can also select a color theme i can change the theme for my zoho so i could i actually just changed it and this is how it looks you can also add your profile picture manage your own zoho people so this is how you can avail zoho people really easily and we get all of the different services that we need to run a successful organization zoho has all the right features and tools for you to track your time add your performance check attendance add leaves add your team members announcement compensation hr letters and more so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you and now you know how to use zoho people as a complete beginner don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up so uh, that's about zoho or people that's it thank you